Hey everyone, this is Nick Orlando with Core AI. And in this video, we're going to be talking about FAQs. So what are they? Why are they important? How should you think about them? Um, and what that experience overall looks like. So let's dive right in. FAQs are usually single turn interactions where the user asks a query and the virtual assistant presents the user with a suitable response from a predefined knowledge repository. And even though they're simpler in nature, FAQs can also possess complex intelligence like context awareness. Um, so essentially what this means, right, is that you can still have very contextual FAQs where you don't need to continue re-specifying certain pieces of information. But an FAQ, you can think of it as overall a question and an answer, right? So for your business, how do you, you know, what are those questions that folks are always asking that you can easily just have a virtual assistant respond to? And then those users don't need to call in and talk to a live person on the phone. So those could be things like your store hours, right? It could be a contact number, right? What is, what is your help number? So a, a phone number or an email address. Um, you know, anything that is just a simple question and answer, you know, where are you located? Anything that the virtual assistant can be trained on so that they can then provide the right response. The other really awesome thing about FAQs here is you don't need to just think about them as a, you know, as a static, here's your question, here's your answer, right? It could be, for example, you know, where are you located? And then the virtual assistant could send a could send the address and maybe it also sends a, a link to Google Maps or Apple Maps. Um, it sends a, a link with the actual location information um, on a uh, on a maps application. So you can also think about the experience that you're defining for your users so that it can be something that isn't just where are you located and they get you know, just a one line response or anything like that. Uh, so this is how you can think about FAQs and how to build them out. Um, so thank you so much for listening in and I look forward to our next conversation.